almost there. That'll do it. いらっしゃいませ。ありがとうございました。I'm ready. Get changed then, would you? Okay, okay. Nice. I think this will work. I know you're in a disguise and all, but don't let your guard down, okay? Try to blend in. Who do you think you're talking to? Hi there. I heard you're having some heater trouble. I'm here to fix it. Yes, it seems to have stopped. Thank you for coming on such short notice. The main unit is just out the door to the left, right around the emergency stairwell. Uh, mind if I take a look at an indoor unit as well? These things can be pretty complicated. Is that really necessary, sir? It'll help me get a better idea of the whole system. I'd rather not bore you with the specifics. Very well then. Sure. There's one in the security office to your left. Thank you very much. I'll have you guys heated up in no time. Suspicious. Uh-huh. 
What the? Hey. Just the guy I was looking for. You're here to fix the heat, yeah? Got something I need you to check out. Oh, sure. No problem. Come on, this way. <laughs> Freezing my balls off, man. Hope this goes quick. Power's on and all, but nothing's happening. Okay, let me see what I can do. Yep, yeah, this thing's seen better days. Thanks, Sherlock. Can you fix it? Hey, genius. If you're gonna fix it, don't you need to take the panel off first? <laughs> hey, what's that? That's something. Never realized it was that simple. Glad I could be of service. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have other repairs to make. Huh? Who are you? Oh, I'm uh, here to repair the heater, sir. Weird. You ain't the usual guy. Where's our man, huh? Never had anyone else come for us. Oh, uh, about that. You know what? I'll just give him another call. See what's up for myself. I'm actually from Comro Maintenance, sir. Have you heard of us? We're small, but, uh, growing? Can't say that I have. Must be new in town. I guess someone else put the call in then. Sorry, sir. I didn't mean to startle you. Yeah, it's all right. Makes sense why I wouldn't recognize you. We fix it or your money back, sir.
this. That'll do it. Just get the hell out of here. Huh? But... Huh? Kaito-san? But I got a call about a broken heater. I told you. We figured it out. All fixed. Nothing to see here. Can I at least check to make sure everything's okay? Oh, and I'll need you to sign this, too. I'm not signing shit. You didn't even fix anything. Now get the hell out of here. Uh, actually, could I borrow your restroom? I'm not feeling so good. Shit yourself for all I care. What? Just here to talk, Murase-san. Look, I risked my life to get in here. Just... I don't have to do shit. You can't boss a Yakuza around!
What the hell are you after, huh? I already said, I just want to talk. Look at this. This is you running away after abandoning Kume. Who do you think you are? I'm a local detective. Hamura's lawyer is having me look into Kume's murder. So what? You're defending Hamura? You think I'm gonna tell you shit, asshole? I thought we already negotiated. You wanna go again? You're not getting out of this unscathed, you know. I know your face now. Do you really think Hamura killed Kume? Of course I do. Who else could have done it? That's what I'm trying to find out. I need to know what happened that night. <sighs> it's as clear as day. Hamura gouged Kume's eyes out. End of story. Yeah? Where? How? In the dump behind a moor. Bastard tortured Kume to death. Actually, the murder happened somewhere else, and I have the evidence to prove it. Take a look at this. What the hell? That's Kume. Suspicious. Sorry, I'm sure this is tough to look at, but as you can see, there's almost no blood around his body. That means he was killed somewhere else, then transported to the alleyway. Oh, I guess so, huh? Mm, doesn't add up, does it? So, you ready to talk now? <sighs> okay, let's take it from the top. Now. After you ran away from Amor, where exactly did you go? You couldn't just let them take Kume, could you? Yeah, I had to do something. So, I went to round up the rest of the clan. We had to take Kume back. But nobody would help, would they? You kidding? Of course they helped. We burst in there ready to bust heads. But I thought nobody else went in or out of Amor. What? You mean because the camera didn't see anyone? <laughs> Funny thing, that. Turns out you can't get seen if the camera's broken. The back alley was our ticket in. So you really went inside? Yep. Not a soul in the house, though. Trust me, we searched the whole damn joint. And when was that? Just after midnight, I suppose. Right when the prosecution says Hamura was laying into Kume. If you're telling the truth, that's a clear contradiction. Huh. Who gives a shit what the prosecution says? Hamura killed Kume, and that's that. Ain't no other way. Maybe so. But the police still need to hear your story. If you could just testify to that... You gotta be kidding me. Why the fuck would I do that, huh? huh? Yeah, it was worth a try. Hmph, <laughs> nice work. So Murase busts into a moor. And who does he find? Absolutely nobody. Yep, Captain Hamura said he kicked Kume out, then hit the sauna right around midnight. The stories match up. You really think he's innocent? Not sure. Our next step is finding proof he was at that sauna. Guess that's that. Well, I'm pooped. How about we call it here for tonight? Yeah, good call. I'll see you tomorrow, Kaito-san.
am I bad? Got it. Hey, you find anything? Sure did. Marase spilled the beans over at the Kyore hideout, a place called KJ Art. And you made it out of there in one piece? Incredible. All in a day's work, Shintani-sensei. So, according to Marase, Amor was empty at midnight on the 3rd. That directly contradicts the prosecution's assertion that Hamuro was beating Kume to death at the time. Well, that's a hell of a find. But is Marase gonna testify? That's not that easy. Uh, it never is. Either way, Marase's telling the truth. I found something that backs his story up. Hmm? This is a moor. Three hours after Hamura took Kume. Midnight. Take a good look at the edge of the screen. We don't see any of them go inside, so I thought nothing of it. But the stories match up. Marase and his guys went to a moor to take Kume back. And they left empty-handed. <sighs> Sounds like we need to talk to Captain Hamura. There are too many unanswered questions. Agreed. I'll set up another visit. Give me a call once you do. Yagami-san, you spoke to Mafio, yes? Huh? Yeah, why do you ask? She seemed happy. It had been a while since she last saw you. Oh, cool? But she looks sad, too. Sad? I wonder why. As do I. See you later. 